how's everybody doing today hope you're great welcome to Uzulu channel today's video is going to be about a product something i seen at the store at walmart actually when we were shopping in uh the cleaning aisle with uh detergents and stuff like that is laundry detergent and what i seen hanging there was this dawn scrubber and here it is right here and now check this out you can take the top comes off and you can add your product in there right I can get shut put your product in there and it has a nozzle in there and you pump it so what we're gonna do today on this truck on the tires since white walls we're gonna put some brake buster in here and see what it does to clean the tires so we're, let's try this out I'm sure you can use other products too in this but this is mainly just for to clean the tires or if you got hard plastic you want to clean up so let's try it out I'm gonna pour it in here Yeah, let's try it out. First time doing it, so I figure why not? If it works, it works. If it doesn't, then you know it don't work. But trying to get it, it's pretty hard bristles too. So I wouldn't put it, use it on your paint. Well, yeah, of course you're not gonna use it on paint. But you can probably use it on your plastic, do an engine bay stuff like that. Let's see, kind of leaks a little bit. It might be too thin. Yeah, it's not too bad. You may want to clean it out before, when you put it away. Don't leave the product in there because I don't. Let's we'll shake it up. Let's go. Let's see if it works. Kind of makes a mess. I gotta really pump it. Yeah, it makes a mess. I think this is a fail. Well, even though it's the product's too thin to go in here, if it's more like a soap, uh, you, we can put a soap in there, or something thicker. Like a dish soap or something like that or if you're going to use a, a soap for your vehicle and that will work good it's just something to really watery down is not going to work that good but it's still this is still a pretty good tool to clean your tires with or any plastic hard plastic engine bay because you can kind of grip it pretty good if you just go like this so i mean and it's only like i think i paid we pay like i think 2.99 for it but it's a pretty good product. Instead of using a brush, you can get a nice grip on it. It's really good to clean those white wells. I mean, the white leathers. But there you go. Let's grit it off. Didn't, uh, this didn't work out having a product inside here you need something uh, thicker like a soap or something it'll work great for here but with no product in here it was great to do get the white letters uh, cleaned up and get the tire clean up so if anyone's ever tried to break buster it worked great at cleaning the white letters on your vehicle look at that it came out really nice so it's an all-in-one thing and then if you like to try this at uh, walmart that's where we picked it up like three dollars um yeah, soap would be better in here. Well, we're worth a sh shot. So, we're worth a shot to try to put some product in here. And why not experiment, you know? That's what the, us detailers like to do. So, but the brake boss did a great job cleaning up the white letters. And this does work good at cleaning out tires. Can get a nice grip. You know, instead of using a brush and going up and down, you can use this to get in here. So, it did, that's, that's a plus on it. We're great for uh, cleaning the tires, just not having a product in there unless it's thick. So just wanted to make a quick video on this. I had an idea when I seen it at the store, I figured why not. So I thank you guys for watching this video, really appreciate it. You guys have a great day, later.